Hi, my name is Kyle Lunsford Hudson. I work for Four Hands Brewing Company and I am the general manager of the tasting room. Uh, today we're working with uh, GS Acoustics to kind of solve a problem we've been having since we opened up our new upstairs tasting room. On any given Friday or Saturday we have about 200 people here. And if you've ever been in a room where 200 people are all talking at the same time and there's constant echoing, it's, it's kind of frustrating. It almost gets to become a nuisance to where you're annoyed with where you're at and you just kind of want to leave. And so here we're all about making everybody comfortable. We have brick, we have a hard concrete floor, we have exposed ceiling, you know, windows, all of this stuff is just hard surfaces, so sound's going to bounce off of them. So what we have to do is come up with creative ideas uh, to make the room, you know, acoustically uh, presentable, but, you know, also uh, preserve the look of the room as well. GNS Acoustics is a national manufacturer of acoustical wall and ceiling panels located here in St. Louis, Missouri. We work with projects, everything from restaurants, breweries like we're here today, to churches, movie theaters, office spaces, schools, universities, any space where you have a lot of people that are gathering and that noise produces a lot of echo or reverberation within the space. So we needed help, we reached out to these nice gentlemen and they're here today to help us solve our problem. The first thing we need to do is come in and test the room. Uh, the way to do that is to excite the room. We want to generate a lot of noise in the room. We want to do it really, really quickly and let it get really loud and then we measure that decay. So we'll be taking uh, uh, six or eight measurements today and we can see where the bad frequencies are, where there's a lot of reflections, what walls are giving us the bad reflections and then we can implement a plan to, uh, to fix that. We will work hand in hand with Kevin on what would be the best product that GNS Acoustics manufactures to put into this space to make sure that we absorb and target the frequencies that they're having the most issues with. I look forward to the day that I can come in here on a Friday or Saturday and, and just have a comfortable noise level. We're back at Four Hands today to do some post testing. The job's been completed, so today we're going to shoot the pistol and uh, analyze that to make sure that the acoustical product that we've put in here falls in line with our acoustical analysis. Yeah, we'll take these back. We'll analyze them at the at the office. Uh, we'll print out the graphs, and I have no doubt they're going to fall right on top of what our estimate was. The room is is really really tuned nicely. We are back at Forehands and we just finished our post testing and wow, what a difference it made to the room. Up on the ceiling, we started with a two inch thick fabric covered acoustical ceiling panel that is mounted up in between the ceiling joist, tucked up out of the way, still effective, yet hidden from the public view. Above the bar, we had our two inch thick Pinta painted acoustical wall panel in the arcade area, because we knew that would be a problem with the sound coming from the skee-ball and the different uh, video games, we've added two inch thick fabric covered acoustical wall panels above the machines on the walls. On the side walls, you see this artwork. That is again, a two inch thick acoustical panel with a custom graphic printed onto the panel. So the goal for acoustically treating this space was speech intelligibility. We were able to bring the re overall reverberation in the space down enough to where two people can sit at a table across from each other and still have a reasonable conversation hearing each other even with a lot of background noise. We finally reached the stage where the installation of all the acoustic panels have been installed and it's significantly better. And so we've got all these nice acoustic panels that you can see installed all along the walls and in the ceiling and some of them you can't even notice, uh, which is great for us because we didn't want to take away from what the space looked like and, and the history of this building because it's so beautiful and it plays so much into the St. Louis history. So these guys came through and they installed these panels that from the common eye, you wouldn't even know they're there, but from the ear, it's amazing. So we can now talk, we can have conversations and we're, we're really happy with it. Mm -hmm. 